we're going to help you learn your New Zealand road code using the mock theory tests at www.drivingtests.co.nz. This will help you get your learner license quicker. Today, we'll look at the signs section. There are 44 questions in total. These are the first 22. This sign shows a bus lane. But because there are no other restrictions underneath the sign, it also means that cyclists, motorcyclists, and moped riders can use the lane. If it said buses only underneath the sign, then only buses are allowed in that lane. This sign shows a roundabout and a give way underneath it. You will give way at any roundabout using the give way rules. So A and B are not correct, and C is the correct answer. You're driving at 100 kilometers per hour and see an accident sign. What speed must you slow down to? The answer is 20 kilometers per hour. Bear in mind that if you don't slow down, you will be doing 80 kilometers an hour over the limit. If you're caught, this means your car will be impounded and you will be disqualified. This sign also means there's a roundabout ahead. This sign says right turning traffic and it will be used in conjunction with another sign giving an order or direction and right turning traffic must obey what that direction or order is. This sign shows that lanes from the left and the right merge into one. This sign, which says temporary, is usually added to a speed limit to indicate that the speed limit in that area is temporary for perhaps roadworks. Why should you slow down when you see this sign? This sign is usually seen around roadworks and it indicates that there will be loose metal or gravel on the road and your tires can throw that gravel up and it can smash another vehicle's windshield. Therefore the answer is D. What color flashing lights does a pilot vehicle have? A pilot vehicle is a vehicle that travels in front of another vehicle that might be, for example, a wide load. And these vehicles have yellow or yellow and purple lights. This sign indicates that a person will be controlling vehicle access to roadworks and you have to stop on request. This sign shows that you're not allowed to do a U-turn. This is a clearway sign, and a clearway is an area of road where you're not allowed to stop and park. This sign indicates that the road ahead will be uneven. This white arrow on a blue background indicates that you should keep left. This yellow sign showing two black arrows in different directions indicates that two-way traffic is ahead. This yellow sign shows two children running and signifies that you should watch out for children on the road. This yellow sign warns of a road hump ahead. This sign indicates that a railway level crossing is ahead. Be prepared to stop. 
half of New Zealand's railway crossings are not controlled by barriers, lights or sirens. This sign shows that there is parking for 30 minutes to the right of the sign. Unless otherwise stated, the sign applies from 8am till 6pm. This is a speed limit sign, showing that the maximum speed is 70 kilometers per hour. You'll see this sign on the approach to a pedestrian crossing. You also may see a white diamond painted on the road. This sign shows a pedestrian and a bicycle, and it indicates that the route is for pedestrians and cyclists only.